It's National Space Day, so many of you, like I, stare off into the great abyss and wonder what is out there. What spaceship should I take? What would I even pack? Man, so uh, while you guys are thinking about it and talking about uh, what our temperatures are going to be looking like, uh, today is also No Pants Day, so I'm wearing my tearaway pants. Can, can see those. I'm not very flexible. Um, so as soon as this is over, I'm going to hop on my spaceship and enjoy the next couple holidays. Um, now it's not going to be as cold as space, <laughs> not even as cold as my ex-girlfriend's heart. Uh, 70s today was not too bad. And then we warm it back up to the 80s, which is very nice, plenty of sunshine, going to be more spring-like. A few fronts come through Monday, Tuesday, so that's why we're seeing some light showers and a few storms on Monday, and same for Tuesday as well, so that being a little bit more active, actually seeing it finally push through, then a high pressure sets up behind, and we see some cooler air coming in from the north Wednesday and even into Thursday, getting back some 80s and 75, so it's going to be cool in the evenings too, so maybe to enjoy space, you know, sit out there and look up at the skies pollution is getting down for a lot of things and seeing more stuff plus i was told by some weary traveler that there's supposed to be meteor showers happening in may some milk moon of some kind i don't know i'm enjoying this view though so i'm gonna enjoy but uh since it's it's no pants day i'm gonna I'm gonna go before i participate in that Enjoy a nice little little whiskey and a wonderful, wonderful space day. So make sure you guys have a great day and a better tomorrow.